And it's a source of never-ending anxiety for parents, drivers speeding in residential areas where kids often play. 10 News reporter Magdala Lusant spoke with one Lynchburg woman who says she's had enough. I don't want anybody to get hurt. Lori Domine has lived on the corner of Robin Drive for three years. It's several instances um, where I've almost been rear-ended turning into my garage and my grandson has also almost been hit while retrieving a ball. Domine has a 15-year-old autistic grandson and three other grandchildren who play outside all the time. She says she worries about her family and the 10 children who live and play near this road. People just fly up and down this road. Drivers coming down Robin Drive from Old Graves Mill Road are supposed to slow down. The speed drops from 35 miles per hour down to 25. I would imagine it would be probably about 50 miles an hour at some point. Mm -hmm. um, there is a hill that goes down beside our house and um, I guess people pick up speed and don't realize what they're doing. She and other neighbors say they've reported the speed concerns to police who have been responsive. Officers actually sat in the neighborhood and monitored the drivers. But it seems like when they're gone that the uh, speed is back up to uh, really high levels. This is not just a problem in Domine's neighborhood. Lynchburg police tell me citizens should call the non-emergency number, report the issue, and it will be forwarded to the traffic unit who will put the appropriate resources in the area. In the meantime, Domine just wonders what else could be done, and while she waits for answers, she has this message. Please slow down because once there's an accident, you can't erase that. In Lynchburg, Magdala Lusant, 10 News, working for you.